All right, we're back, everyone. It uh, it looks a little bit foggy out there. I'm lagging a little bit. Just the game's just starting up. Don't worry about that. All right, looking at our equipment, we uh, we have some bars and stuff, which is great. So I think for the next couple of sessions here, we're gonna try focusing specifically on killing zombies. All right, it's gonna be the plan. And to do that, we're gonna go start by going to the, the, the Northwest where we died a couple of lives ago to try and reclaim our equipment. Um, because I did have some Molotovs and you know some stuff like that on there. Uh, I think our firefighter gear right now is better, judging by how much it has protected us um, from getting like just insta gibbed by people. That's great. Um, excuse me, what happened to my wall? What the fuck? They really just destroy my wall down here. Bro, that's so fuck. They destroyed my crate here too? Those shitty zombies. At least this wall seems to be intact. Well. I don't even know why they would do that. That's just so rude of them to attack that wall. Oof, I do not like this though. So our first goal of the day, go back to where we died in this house structure because we left a lead pipe in there and I wanna grab that because it uh, it's another weapon we can use. And since we're gonna be killing zombies a lot, <clears throat> and our highest skill is in blunt weapons and maintenance. I think it will be uh, essential for us to have as many of them as possible. We also have to be careful about how we get into these stupid buildings here. Okay. If we open up our thing, we should see on the ground... lead pipe somewhere. Where's it at? Where the fuck's it at? Is there really no lead pipe here? Maybe I dropped it outside further when I was running in here or something. Or maybe it actually just broke when I was uh, fighting them. Anyway, we can probably just come into here, take a look down this hallway. I don't see it on the ground anywhere. Okay, well, we're going to head up north here further, so we're just going to sneak around a little bit. My only concern is the fog is going to limit my visibility by quite a lot. We have to get into this structure here, I think. We'll just carefully uh, watch where we're going. Are the zombie coming towards me or are they? Yep, they are. Okay, let's kill them. Oh, get wrecked, bro. Okay. The problem is there was a huge horde of zombies that we had trekked in here before. So we're going to have to be careful. Oh. Hmm. Yep. I don't know if that huge horde that we were transporting in here tried to kill a Molotov. I don't know if they are still in here. Or if they're somewhere else. Maybe we, uh... This is like a car park. What if we try to clear this place first? Oh my 
The guy's doing work with his axe, though. God dang. I saw one behind me. Yes, I did. Oh. There might be a couple of zombies over there. At least there's not fog in here. I think we're gonna just skedaddle out of here. And uh, get to the stairs. Get to where we had died previously. <laughs> I don't think I want to deal with that huge horde of zombies. Also, look like there's a bunch of metal bars and stuff in here that we can use as weapons. So that's, that's going to be great. Get snuck up behind. That's all we gotta do. Just knock it snuck up behind. Or lure a huge horde. Either way. Check the back. We're good. Oh, fuck. Come on. Bugger off, y'all. I said bugger off. No way I died. What? We were doing just fine, and then all of a sudden, we got bit? Like, what the fuck? I don't understand. I, I just I just don't understand. I'll, I'll tell you what, I'm getting real tired of dying for, like, no real reason. Like, we have dealt with larger hordes than that and been fine. And now let me guess, we're all the way in the bottom right of the fucking map. Yep. <sighs> Hold on one second. Let's see here. I'm just going to see if I can set a spawn point because I'm quite frankly tired of fucking walking back all the damn time. Let's see... Mm -hmm. Yeah, it looks like the only thing that they have is, like, server-related stuff there, which sucks. God damn it. Well, might as well just die then. Oh my god, has a little hat on. I'm talking there's no zombie. Why is this, why is it this house? Like, what is with this particular house and spawning me right next to it? I just don't get it. Let's see if we can get spawned closer. Yeah, I guess the thing is, we just can never, ever um, fight indoors. Always go outside. That's, that's going to be the rule. We just have to go inside, lure zombies out, and then when they're outside, we can kill them. We just can never fight indoors. 
I jump over here? No, okay, let's try the front door then. I'm not even gonna worry about getting a weapon or anything. Locked. Hey, zombie. Get on the fucking ground. I ain't playing with this nonsense. Hey, look, it's the tool store. Oh, right, I remember how we turn on the debug mode. We have to actually go and uh, change the Steam, like, launch settings to have, like, dash debug in it or something like that. How many more times do you guys think I'm going to die before we end up uh, getting stuff back? I think I'll go down this road. I think instead of going home, I'm just going to try to get our stuff. Because, I mean, what, what, what's the point in going back home and fucking learning all the stats just to die again, right? I'm sure it might only take a couple of minutes, but I'd much rather get our stuff and go. And we can just go and uh, pick up one of the metal bars from the warehouse area there. The storage units, whatever the hell they are. I might be a little tired by the time we get there, but whatever, I don't care. We'll figure it out. We'll see what happens when we actually get up that way. Maybe I jump this fence and just on this on this side of the fence. I, oh, this is a great place right here. We have a wooden fence and we have a metal fence, so we're protected unless a zombie is in here. Which why would they be in here? He says seeing a zombie in here. Okay, whatever, we can kill him. It's fine if I can see. Hey, buddy. I thought you had a backpack on. Looked like you did. Alright, get ready, set, and we're running out of here. Because, yep. I figured there's going to be a guy there who was ready to grab me. I just have to check where we got to turn here in a moment. I think it's a couple more blocks down or so. Let's see, what are these places? Office building or an empty building? I can't tell which. We've got a office of some sort, maybe a hairstyle, hair salon there. This looks like a grocery store. Ooh. Okay. Up on the map, we are here. We just have to get to here. So two more block kind of things, I think. I had to look really quick, so I'm not sure if that's true or not. But uh, yeah. Also, I wanted to look up what Nimble does. I wish I told you like little tool tips about like what the stats did. Because that's one of the stats we haven't really leveled up much on our main stat thing, right? What was it? This green taxi we had a key to? So this is one block, so I think one more, and then we'll head to that. Red brick restaurant. Okay, let's try to kill this one zombie who's just kind of here. Why not this one too? Come on. Come on, you wolverine looking motherfucker. Let's go. Oh my god, it's angry at the world. He's been in his house for months. He's a little stir crazy. He's finally lost his mind. That's this guy's war anyway. Finally ready to come and curb stomp the damn zombies to death. 
Oh, you want some too, lady? Come here. Come on. Ugh. Actually, surprisingly good at killing the zombies in the uh, melee. Uh, there's multiple keys here. Let me just crouch down and uh, these keys. Oh, there's another one down there. I want all these keys. at me. Guy yeah, is getting exhausted though, which is not ideal. For dealing with this. What? My ass, you fucking got me there. Come on. Come on. We stomp one of them out. What the fuck? Stomp him! I learned is if you stand on the zombie, it can't get up. That's great. Alright, so we got two of these keys, I think they are for. Is there just one more zombie down here? Yeah, I think there is. Let's go ahead and finish that one off. And we can rest in this like corner here. Excellent. Let's pick up this key. It's another one of them, okay. Which I believe is, is those. That's interesting. Anything in this uh, trunk here? Wrench? All right, let's take a minute. We're gonna sit down and rest until we uh, get that taken care of. So is this uh, a key to one of these? It is. Nothing special inside it at the moment, though. Can I not get into the... Hmm. Doesn't look very good. Let's put on this jacket. I don't want the bread knife, but... If you look at the vehicle mechanics of this, it's, uh... Yeah, it's, it's fucked. Hmm. For some reason, I can't get into the car, but... Fine, whatever. Okay, so... so I have that one, that one... some cigarettes and matches. Take those. Should also look for something to uh to drink. Okay. I'm the ambulance. Nothing. What if I Wait, I forgot about that. Hold on. What? what? Come on. Motherfuckers. I should not have gotten hit there. I definitely hit the melee button. Uh, let's see. Alcohol wipes. Oh, we got some gloves now. We can put those on. Let's step out of here. Take a look at the trunk. Uh, antidepressants, medical pants, scalpel, suture needle, trauma bag. I haven't seen one of those before. All right. Well. Uh, 
not much else to do here yet. Shame that this trauma bag doesn't like have more capacity and stuff. Huh. I don't have a key to this one, huh? Where's the other one of those cars then? That one? But not that. Alright. See the map quick. We are here, so we just gotta go there. Get our stuff. Waters for winners, and we're not winning right now, so. Gigamart? Of course, we're in pain, so we're gonna have reduced melee ability. Was it down? Oh, there's another key. I think that's for that car. Oh, there's another key up there. You see it? Right there? I'm getting good at spotting keys on the game. Uh, Matterson Horizon. Hm. Alone. Put that in the medical bag. Why not? Like the matter, her son, her, 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 whatever. Locked. It's not, huh? I've never actually seen that vehicle before, so. Or I guess had keys for one. So I don't know what it's called. I think that's something completely different. Okay. Where the hell is the place we're going? Oh no, it's over here. No, wait, yeah, it's a ship. Hmm? It's that one. That's the one we're looking for. I thought it was the L-shaped place, but it's not. That is a couple of zombies right there. Get this. No, it's the next one over, so we're gonna have to go down, possibly around. Get any of those. Requires an item in my hand. Of course it does. Okay, let's check these doors. Okay. Let's look nicely. Okay. See if I can find anything decent in here real quick. We can drink this pop. That'll give me a hunger back. And then also grab this water bottle that's luckily filled. Perfect. And I can get out those windows right there. Let's make a quick stop to the uh, area over here. I'm going to eat a whole thing of mac and cheese real quick. There we go. All right. Now we're well fed. Out <clears throat> any of this shit. You, uh, see all those zombies out there? I did. Run away. Fuck, that's the... We don't want to go in there. Not right now. Uh-oh. 
Uh, we're gonna go over here. Oh no. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Okay. Okay, you guys wanna play it this way? Come on. Come on, zombies. Let's go. Come on. Mm-hmm. Funny losers. Don't push, just stop. He should have been stomped, but okay. Hmm. Oh, hey, police officer. <clears throat> don't mind me, just gonna walk away from you now. I don't know how he got in here without me noticing. No, don't push! Hit! Oh my god, why, why does he do this? I don't understand. It. No, stomp their heads. Oh my god. The attacking in this game is just so stupid sometimes. It doesn't make sense. I should, I should have killed like five more by now. Like, why am I fucking pushing that guy when... At least I'm luring them away from the uh, area that I want to be in. Nope. I got two there. I think two is the limit of what I can do at the moment. At least in a row next to each other. Oh, come on, that was a fucking... Ah! Where sometimes my characters are just like brain dead for whatever reason. Okay. Are we running back? Oh, they uh, decided to just destroy that fence instead, I see. Okay. That one too, huh? I'm just gonna. Yerp. Come on, just. Oh my god. What are the other ones doing? Huh? Next, uh... Oh, nope. Excuse me. Pardon me. I mean, I kill him as quick because I'm, uh, exhausted or something. Yep, got through that time. <laughs> get fucking nerds. Now, I don't want to go in one of these houses because I feel like if I go in one of the houses, uh, I'll have a bad time. That works for me. All right, we're gonna turn. We're gonna sit. Sit on the ground. We're gonna speed up time a little bit until I have to get up, just so we can uh, get our exhaustion down a bit. Yep, that's not gonna work. Turn. Uh, I don't think I have time to sit there. It's fine though. All right. Oh, there's another fucking huge group there. If I had a weapon. I think I could do a little bit better, but sadly I don't have one at the moment. Oh, that door's locked. That door's locked. That door's locked. Yeah, this door's open. We wouldn't use that to our advantage. 
That's not the door I wanted to open. Excuse me, where did all those zombies come from? Were they all sitting at the same exact, like, cube or something? That's not okay. okay we're getting to the point where we're just getting tired for no reason. It might be best to uh, go back to our tower, rest up, uh, heal our wounds. Because keep in mind, when we're in pain, we do 15% less damage and less speed, so it's just not good for us. But luckily, our, our area is pretty secure at the moment, so... I'm just climbing up here. We also have some medical supplies that I'd like to, you know, save, so... I don't want to lose this stuff again. Okay. Well, it was a good effort. It'd be nice if we could see what time it was. But, uh... Yeah. Good thing we don't have a lock on our door that would, uh, give us problems, you know. I'm going to place this trauma bag, like, right here. And I'm going to take everything out of the trauma bag into my inventory. And we're going to put it in the sink. There we go. All right. Let's go ahead and uh, clean our bandages and stuff, because we have some problems here. So we'll disinfect. Use an adhesive bandage. Why not? Remove bandages. Disinfect with cologne, bandage with adhesive bandages, since they're basically consumable and can't be washed. Might as well. All right. Ooh. Clean our dirty rags. Drink. Incidentally, um, how many kills do we have so far? 40 with our bare hands. We have killed 40 zombies with our bare hands, ladies and gentlemen. Adam Wallace, you might just be the next great thing. We'll see. Go ahead and read this just so we can get our stats back. I wasn't going to, but uh, it kind of turned out that way. I wasn't going to yet anyway, so. Did it just rise? There we go. All right, journal can go back in there. Man. I'm gonna rest. Okay. So I think at this point, I'm going to go ahead and just unequip our mask, because that's not really doing anything for us. I'll keep the gloves on. I'm going to put the mask in here. Because the mask doesn't really, you know, help us do anything. It doesn't provide much protection or anything. So, it's just going to weigh us down a little bit when we inevitably get our stuff back. While we're waiting here, it is currently nighttime, it looks like. I'm just going to sit on the ground and let's speed up time. I'm just going to basically wait until we're tired or daylight comes so that way we can, you know, sleep. But first, let's go eat. Also, replace these bandages. The nice thing is that we, uh, aren't infected anymore there, so that's great. I feel like our guys are just 
uh, the last couple of guys we've had in here have just been wasting food. They haven't really had any time to use the food effectively. I mean, I could take these tools and just go ham around here, removing stuff, right? Maybe I do that. If I do that, I would want more carpentry experience, so I'd want to read a book in order to do it. So you know what? Let's do that. Let's 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 just do that. Read our carpentry book. Sit on the ground, and either we're gonna get tired to the point we can sleep, or it'll get uh, morning out here. So I should have grabbed a wristwatch off of one of the zombies that we've killed. Okay. It looks like it's morning. We can sleep now. We're going to sleep. Yes. Gotta real quickly, just bypass us. Okay. How are our bandages looking? They're dirty once again. Excellent. Let's take a smoke. Remove bandages. Oop. Let's go ahead and replace them. Be nice if one of them was healed, but nope. We're just gonna be in pain all day, it looks like. Clean the rag. Fill our water bottle. Take a drink. And we'll eat uh something else here. Um What do we have we can eat just real quick, like? Hmm. I don't wanna have to like open it and then all that nonsense. Mac and cheese, why not? We'll eat that. Okay. Right. All right, so we're going to go and try to get to that building again, right? And once we're there, we're going to pick up one of the pipes off the ground that we can have rather than just take from our storage area. At least it's not foggy, so we can actually see a uh, decent ways ahead of us. Don't have to worry about that. The one problem we're going to have is pain. Where if we get in any more pain than this, we're going to have our uh, stuff reduced. At some point, we're going to have to like clear all these buildings just to get zombies out of them, but then the zombies are going to keep moving around the map and stuff, so you never know. Alright. I'm just going to look down this hall real quick, make sure there's no zombies near there. Okay. And we're going to crouch and head over to there. I don't know if I should kill that guy. Or just go in here. Well, another one just jumped out of the fucking thing there, so... Let's see what these guys decide to do. Oh, they're coming for me. That's fine. Uh, from behind? Where did that one come from? Is that gunfire? Uh, what should I do? Why did that only do that much damage? No, for fuck's sake. No, no! Get the hell off me. Fuck all of you. I was about to die again there. Did you see that? It's like the zombies have a fucking hive mind. What the hell? They just all of a sudden, like... Heard the zombies rustling or something. Hold on. Zombie lore. Didn't I change hearing to be like four before? I thought I did. Apparently I was mistaken or something happened. Um. 
environmental attacks. Zombies that have not seen or heard can attack doors. Yeah, we don't want that. Um, so again, I don't know why they were attacking the walls that are down there. That's weird. Um, that's so weird. Why are the zombies like pinpoint on me, right? It makes no sense. But now I'm in more pain, so of course my damage is screwed. But I kill this one. Hmm? Bully his ass. Nope. I'm probably gonna have to go fucking get a, a weapon from my store and then like deal with these assholes. You know what? No. That's what I think about y'all, middle finger. Let's take out these two. They're easy enough looking prey. The third one joins. Damn. Fall on the ground, old man. Fall on the ground. What the fuck is this? Skedaddle, real quick, like. Oh, now the third one's coming too, huh? And they're spaced out just enough to piss me off as well. That's excellent. Hey, you stay on the ground. friends. Luckily there's fucking no one down here. Is that a zombie on the other side of the fence? That is. Why are they there? Why are there zombies down there? I'm not making a bunch of noise or anything. They have no reason to be there. Those guys are all collecting together. All right, how about this? Come on, losers! Luckily, we have some fences up here we can use. Hopefully stomp these boys out. Slowly but surely, anyway. As long as there's not another horde of zombies up here, right? <laughs> oh man, some of these fences are broke. At least we can lure them all up here. And then we can... Well, while they're caught on the fence, we can make our way back down there. And hopefully they'll get lost up here. Come on, losers. Yeah. Come on. And now we run this way. Is this the building we're trying to get into? I think it is. Yeah, I'm gonna take a peek inside here real quick. Yep, nope. I want that. I probably made a mistake by going over here. Now there's gonna be more zombies down this way. We're just gonna juke them. We're going over the fence here. And juke them to doing that. I'm gonna stop on this lady's fucking head. There's one more dead zombie is good for us, so. So I can push this guy over and stomp him the brains. Push him over. Push him over. Bully him. Let's go. Come on. Uh. We we're exhausted, so that's lovely. All right, let's make our way down here quick. Hopefully, we can lose the zombies. At least a little bit. I'm going to sit down. We're going to speed up time a little bit. Okay. I'd at least like to get a pipe. That'd be cool. 
Come on, man. Why did you have to come out of the window at this particular moment in time, huh? Just fall over. Fall over, but shit, most fucking cones, man. Come on. These zombies just don't want me to kill them. Okay. I just want this. Leave me alone. Okay, I don't see any zombies behind me. I should be able to take these guys out with my metal pipe. That's the head. Come on. There we go. All right. We'll walk away for a second. We got another bozo over here. Is there like a party going on in that room over there? I started going behind me, so I wanted to turn and look. There's a couple boys in there. Hey! Hey, come on! I'm over here now, come on. Come to the window. Why is that window open? I thought, was, I thought it was closed. Okay. I'm just going to wait here for another moment. I do not like how much pain we're in right now. That's less than ideal. But here's the idea. We're gonna try to get in here, find some more zombies to kill, and hopefully avoid going into a place that has a shit ton of them. I have a hunch. I'm just going to walk out for now. Mm -hmm. I was getting goosebumps. <laughs> I was right. more, but it looks like it's not really possible. There we go. Come on. Get them. Hell yeah. Now that was a good bit of damage. Hey, come here. Come on. Yeah, I figured that one might come out the doorway. 
check our backs. We're good. Let's take a quick smoke break, because I feel like our anxiety is going to go up here in a moment. <clears throat> It'd be cool if cigarettes also dulled our pain a little bit. Sadly, I don't think that's the case. I'm going to rotate around a bit. Okay. Let's face this way. I'm going to sit on the ground. We have time a little bit. Just so we can uh, just chill out. Mm. Oh! Fucking hell, lady. Come on. Pop her head. There we go. What? How do I swing through the zombies sometimes? He's coming out. Let's go. Fuck. Came in the wrong direction. I was really concerned about the zombies that were down there. Yeah, come on, buddy. That was one more of you in there. Come on. Let me just lure him out a little bit further. There we go. Oh, there goes that one. I just kicked him in the side of the face. All right. Got that metal bar. Get the fuck out. Fucking equip it. should have been a hit. I don't know how sneaking just got up, since I'm not sneaking at all. But, I'll take it. How's our back looking? Good. Let's take a peek through here again. I'm gonna have to clear out like this whole fucking place before I can get my bodies, huh? Oi! You lot! That's what I thought. Come on. Yeah, cool. He's coming from here. Got another one. Perfect. No. Hit the ground. Hit the ground. Oh, my God. The... Where did that one come from? Why did I miss him? I already cleared that little thing there, so once they came from, like, inside or outside, then inside, then outside again. It's just weird. Why are zombies like this guy? I really wish those doors were still closed. Be over here. Psst. Hey. Damn it. There's another one in that thing there, huh? Okay. Stuck up behind by that fucking little crawlway that's there. Damn it. One shows the door, one shows the window. That's not ideal. Oh, come on. Fuck off. Where did they come from? This fucking game is shit. It is so shit. Like, what the hell? Is 
It's getting to the point that I don't even want to fucking play anymore. Like... What am I doing wrong? Why are zombies wandering in from, like, where there's no zombies at before? I turned down their hearing so they can't be, like, hearing me from miles away, right? Fucking ridiculous nonsense. Gavin, you're next on the kill order. Where the hell are we at? Okay, we're not that far away, at least. One second. Let's try turning on aim outline. Keep the mouse cursor inside the window when enabled. The system cursor is hidden and the game renders its own cursor. What does that mean? Oh, whatever. Oh, no, that was the wrong thing. Highlights the zombies the player is aiming at. Okay. Accept. Resume. Let me just check the zombie thing here again. Yeah, I don't really get it. I'm just gonna give him short memory too. Because why not at this point? I'm trying to figure out what the hell I can do here to try and not die immediately when I get like a zombie touching my butt for some reason. Like it's ridiculous, what I'm saying. Like, I should not be dying as easily as I am here. Like, you know, it's just one thing if I'm, you know, like my other guys have been, where I would, you know, run into um, a building, not clear it floor by floor or anything, and I got surrounded that way. Sure, whatever. But when I look behind myself, and it's clear and I start fighting zombies, and then I just fight them for like a minute, maybe, and then a zombie comes from behind me and basically ruins the run. I don't get it. Like, I cannot be making that much noise, right? Especially when they have poor here. It's a little bit ridiculous. Let me just check something out here quick. Okay, so I can tell when I'd be able to push them and stuff. And who I'm gonna hit. I'm doing that. So if they're green, I should be able to hit them, I guess. I don't been a bad couple of days, folks. I don't know what more, like, I can do other than, I guess, like, what I have been doing. Uh, when I cleared out our, our tower, like, going into that gated area where there's literally no way I can be snuck up behind. I guess I'm gonna have to do that.
family fun zone. I think just for the rest of this video, though, we're just going to run home. I'm going to learn my stats. And then we'll just kind of go from there. So if you uh, want to quit watching now, and then just kind of start on the next video, feel free to do so. zombies ahead of me and I'm just gonna have time to kill them because I have zombies behind me there too. Oh they really decided to go in between that fence, huh? These fences are kind of nostalgic for me. When there's like a sandwich and like a path between them, right? I uh in my town there's one of those kind of things. It's kinda of neat. I, I like going through it. I think there was a couple of them actually. It was interesting. But anyway. Let's pull this guy. Or girl, I guess. Man, our last guy was so good. He was like stomping them in like one hit and killing them. I guess that's maybe because he wasn't exhausted like I am right now, but whatever. Alright, let's hit this next road and go south. I thought I wore actual pants. Why do I still see my socks? Oh, it's so dark I can't see. Let's just walk for a moment. Check these mailboxes as I go. A little farming magazine. Hold on. Oh. Let's just play some making stuff there. I don't care about that. I thought it was gonna be like. Well, I thought this was like a building in the hospital where the ambulance crashed through it or something. I was like, what the fuck? Incidentally, it has not rained for so long. Like, I don't remember the last time it's rained, you guys. It's, it's been probably days. And I even... I even went to nature and changed it so rain happens frequently. Because it was normal before, but I made it rainy. So... I don't know why it's not actually raining. Maybe I'm just not, like seeing the rain? That can't be it, because I've gone to the roof and looked at the uh, water boxes and there's nothing there. But I don't have rope anywhere over there anymore. So many zombies got in and decided that they were just going to say through you to my lovely collection of rope things. Uh, this game seems like very hit or miss like sometimes I do really well for like a long period of time and then something wonky happens and I just die and lose all my progress so it uh, kind of sucks anyway I want a water bottle I'm gonna, I'm gonna take this bottle this former bleach bottle that has water and I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna take it All right, folks, well, I'm going to go ahead and just read from my journal here and uh, learn all of our stats once again. So now that that's done, I think what we'll do is uh, we'll try to go back and get our bodies and stuff. I'm, I'm probably going to grab one of the weapons out of my storage here. And we will, uh, I guess, if we open up the map here, so... 
this is where we've been fighting, right? This huge building here, because there's a huge parking garage here. And right here, there's that, like, uh, fence, right? If we just lure them in here after we clear this fence area out, we will know that that area behind us is safe, right? At least that's the theory. Um, then we can just jump over it and run, and if we need to, we can jump over that and head home, right? So, I don't know. I'm just getting tired of dying and having to run over here. It's, it's been like, we've, we've probably spent a good hour of recording just like running back to our home or more. And it's, it's, it's you know, thank God for this bound journal so I don't have to relearn everything every single time. But God dang. Uh, all right. Till next time. Bye bye.